Good morning, guys. I just finished up with my workout. Um, I'm about to go out to the kitchen and living room and have a cup of coffee and um, go ahead and read our unit for history and um, prepare for our afternoon. We actually are having a Christmas party with our CC community today, um, and that's going to be around lunchtime, so I think it starts at 1. Um, and it's currently, let's see, it's currently 1030 already. So I am obviously, <laughs> um, not doing things early today. I slept in, my kids slept in, and so we're just going to take care of our unit history, or we're just going to take care of our lesson in our, um, gather around U.S. history this morning, and then start getting ready to go, um, to our Christmas party. We have... We're doing a, Chris, um, a book exchange um, amongst the classes, and so I need to get those books wrapped up for them and then get my car packed up with all of the things that I'm donating for um, the Christmas party lunch and the games and things of that sort, and then we'll head out, hopefully get there on time, um, but getting to things on time, honestly, it's hard for us. I don't know why, because my husband and I, like... Before we had kids, we were pretty punctual people. <laughs> um, and the more kids we added, the later we got. So I don't know what's up with that, but that's how we do life. So um, anyways, I'm going to go ahead and go get some coffee and get that lesson um, read here really quickly. Okay, guys. Um, done reading our lesson, and um, I've been drinking some coffee before I go and work out. It's okay. Put it down. Um, I had a, I, because of the Christmas party, I needed some stuff from Walmart and I really didn't feel like having to go today. So I put in an order to have it delivered this morning and I'll just show you guys really quickly what I got. Um, I got a few of these really cute little tiny gift bags. I thought they were a little bit bigger, um, but I'm sure I'll find use out of these anyways. So I got... Um, three of these here, uh, three of these, and then three of these. And I was going to put the books in these bags, but the books are way too big for these tiny little things. Um, so I'm just going to put some gifts in there for uh, the wonderful women that are the tutors at CC for my kids. Um, so I bought, these are really cute and tiny too. <laughs> Um, I got these little chocolates to go inside their gifts. And then I'm probably going to see if I can purchase online and like print out the card, um, some Starbucks gift cards because I couldn't buy them online from Walmart for delivery. I got some candy canes. We're going to use these for the candy cane experiment and also for stockings. Um, I wanted cookie icing. They had to sub it out. And instead of replacing, I guess they, they might be out of all of the cookie icing. So, um, I don't know. This is cupcake and cake icing. I don't know how this is going to work on the cookies. Maybe we'll try it for one batch and see how it goes. Or I'll just bake some cupcakes and use this and then just go and purchase the icing that I wanted. And I have a recipe for sugar cookies, but I also wanted to invite some friends over for cookie decorating. So in order to make that happen and make it happen quicker than doing a, a batch of um, from scratch cookies, I just purchased a couple of these. Um, I've never used this for, I've never used this before. I usually just make cookies, um, sugar cookies from scratch, but it was kind of tempting. So I just did it just to make my life a little bit easier. And then I got some all purpose flour, need that to make um, other cookies. <laughs> And then for our holiday party, I signed up to bring a veggie tray. So I was gonna—I picked up two, and I probably should have picked up four. I had no idea that these were so small. Um, this was the only option that Walmart had on the grocery pickup or grocery delivery order pickup, whatever it is. And I thought it was bigger than this, but anyways, I got two of these, so hopefully that's enough. And then I just got lots of different sprinkles for the cookies and I guess now cupcakes. Um, so I got these Christmassy sprinkles. 
So I got these Christmas sprinkles here, just those colors. And then I got this color here, which is like a wintry blue, white, and silver. Um, there's that one. Then I got this sprinkle mix here, which is like red, white, and gold. And then I got this one here, which um, is another white, blue, and silver sprinkle mix. And that is all that I picked up for Walmart. Um, I really only truly needed the veggie tray, but in order for them to deliver it, you have to order $35 worth. So then I decided to get stuff to make cookies. <laughs> Um, so I'm going to clean this up and I'm actually, it's already 1117. Um, my husband's putting the toddler down for a nap. So I, while he's doing that, I'm going to shower, get these books wrapped, get these little gift bags made. Um, and yeah, that's what I'm going to do. Okay. Hey guys, I just finished, um, getting my shower, getting dressed, getting my makeup done and, um, it's 12:23, so I really got to get on it. I am getting these um, Christmas gifts ready for the tutors. So I like to buy gift sets from companies and um, break them up for like smaller gifts for people. So that's what I'm going to be doing for these gifts. So um, I'll just show you guys what I'm putting in there. Um, the first thing I'm going to do is I have a couple of the gift sets from Beauty Counter that have these eye masks in them. So I'm going to give each one of their tutors one of those. Um, candy canes because why not you guys saw earlier these chocolates I'm gonna give them some of those and then um, I have these I have a couple of these gift sets and these are um, these are called jellies and they're also from beauty counter and they're just little lip glosses um, they're super cute and fun so I'm gonna add those in there and then I have I've given out um, a couple of other gifts already so I only have two of these left and these are hand creams from beauty counter um that i'm going to be giving and then for the other tutor i'm going to give her this really cute bracelet i have a ton of these um to add as extras to gifts that i'm giving to people and so she'll get one of these and it's just a beaded bracelet it's from the brand um paparazzi i have a friend that sells this and so i bought a ton of these and it just says trust in the lord here so trust in the Lord. And so she is going to get this. So I'm going to, and also I'm adding in a Christmas card for each one of them. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and quickly get these all packed up into a gift bag. Um, if you hear my toddler crying, he's out there with my husband. I promise he's not being neglected. He's, um, my husband's getting him dressed. He has to head to the office and we're heading to the Christmas party. So he's helping me out, um, so I can get this stuff done. But anyways, so I'm going to get these gifts taken care of. And then also I still have to wrap up these books that we are, um, putting in as a part of the book exchange. They are I purchased some book sets and some extra books and so I told my kids just to go shopping in our brand new books and so that's what they did. We had doubles of this one so we're going to gift away one we're going to so we're going to put this one in the gift exchange and it's one crazy summer. This is just the second copy that we have that's brand new. And so the other book that we have um that is new that I got is A Wolf in North Woods and I picked this up from The Good and the Beautiful. So um, my youngest will put that one in and then another one that we have is uh, this is also a duplicate that we had so we used one of them and then the other one hasn't been touched because it came in a set and so this is I survived the sinking of the Titanic 1912 so I don't have a problem like buying gift sets if they come with books that I already have because of reasons like this um, there's someone who you can always find to give a book away to or you can gift them to someone else so never feel like you have to like not buy a book set that has lots of other books in it just because one of them or two of them you might already have um that's just saves you money because you're buying it in a set and then you can shop your own collection later <laughs> um so i'm gonna go ahead and get all of this ready and i will just um turn the camera And I'm going to use these cute tiny little bags that are actually coming in handy. Um, even though they were smaller than I was expecting, I have three of them. So going to put them to use.
Okay guys, so I have um, gift bagged the Tudor gifts and I have wrapped up the three books. Not my best wrapping, but it's gonna get tore up anyways. Um, so we are ready to go. I am going to go have my son start to get the car packed up with um, the veggie trays and to have my daughter get the gifts and then I gotta gather around my two youngest and we are going to be on our way to the Christmas party. Um, so I will catch back up with you guys. We aren't going to stay for the whole party because my daughter, my youngest has danced today. Um, she does a combo ballet tap jazz class and so she has that today and um, the di like where our CC community is, is about 40 minutes away from us and so, you know, I'm already running late there so I don't, it's kind of, so I think I mentioned before, we live in a smaller town and so it's, it is growing rapidly. However, the infrastructure hasn't grown as quickly as the population. So a lot of traffic backs up, the roads are still small, they're working on it, um, but we get backed up a lot because of traffic. So we can't hang out too long. We're gonna go um, drop off our stuff. My kids go run around and have fun for a little bit, hang out with their friends. And then we have to hop back in the car and come back to our town to um, get my daughter off to dance. So I don't think that I'm going to bring you guys along at CC Community because there's lots of other people, lots of other families and their kids. And um, out of respect of their privacy, I'm just not um, going to do that. So I will catch back up with you guys a little bit later and um, like fill you guys in on how we're doing and how our day has gone. So I'll see you guys here in a bit. Hey guys, um, it has been quite a while. And um, it's already 6.13, I just got home. So I am hanging up my diaper bag and my purse, um, unpacking from the day. So <laughs> we showed up to our Christmas party so, so late. Um, we got there about 45 minutes late because I left in enough time for us to get there um, on time and everything would have been good. But then, oh, my lips are so chapped. But then I realized that I forgot the water bottle. Hi, are you having a candy cane? Okay, go eat. Go eat, go sit down. Thank you. Careful. Can you take your shoes off? Shoes off? So I realized that I forgot the toilet paper that I was supposed to take and the water bottles that I was supposed to take. We packed up everything else that we needed and we were on our way there and then suddenly realized we forgot those. So we had to turn around and come back home and pick that stuff up and then head back out there, get out there. We got there, we were late, but it was fine. It was so amazing and so fun. Um, we had some very delicious brisket and all of the fixings and desserts and sides that you could think of. And we had so much fun with our games and we did a book exchange, which was really good. All of my kids are excited with the books that they got. And it would appear that the kids that ended up with the books that they decided to, um, put in the book exchange, they were happy with those as well. So that was good. And then I stopped over at a friend's house and she was so sweet she gave me these um bible highlighters from daily grace and co i think it's called um and these are super cute and so she gave me those and then i had her and i she's actually a beauty counter rep which i am not even though i have shown a beauty counter on here before i'm just a very um happy customer and Daddy. yes and so um, we, since she's a consultant, she was able to purchase this like, this one um, kit with these different gift sets in there. And so we went half and we both got the, um, we got this beauty counter kit here and it is cream eyeshadows and I'll show you these. So there's these cream eyeshadows, which are so pretty. Um, they are really pretty online and in the picture. And in person, they are 
even better. Like they're so good. I've never used a cream shadow before. So I'm actually really excited to um, use these and see how they work. And then we got, this is something that I've been waiting for Beauty, Beauty Counter to release for years because I just always thought that if they did it, it would be better than anything on the market. And they finally did. They released um, their own brand of deodorant. And this is just the mini size gift set. So I have these here. Um, and I'm so excited to try these out. I believe they also, they, they have a bigger size. I'm not sure if they're available online. So I'm really excited for those stuff. So on our way home from um, CC, I dropped off my six-year-old at dance. And then we headed um, to my friend's house. And the kids that I had got to have a play date with her kids. She has four kids just like I do. And all of her kids are similar ages to my kids. So it works out really, really nicely that all of my kids pair off and have a friend to play with. Um, and so, yeah, that's just where I'm at. Unpacking and putting things away and I think we're going to have leftover leftovers from yesterday for dinner because it's already too late for me to cook anything um so I think that so we are going to do so yesterday for dinner we had a gluten-free lasagna that I made um in the crock pot so I am just going to reheat that up for dinner, and that's what we are going to have for dinner tonight. Um, probably with some leftover green beans as well. But this is, I'll show you guys. This is the um, basket of toilet paper that was left over. Both the, we did a snowman game where kids were wrapping up people in, or wrapping up partners in toilet paper for snowmen, and so, this is what was left over and I got to bring it all home. And so I'll show you really quickly the books that my kids got in the book exchange. My eight year old got the um, National Geographic Kids 2021 Almanac. So there's that, which my two year old is loving that. And then my other daughter got a Discovery Kids Animals Discover the Secrets of the Natural World, which is this here. And then my son got a series of unfortunate events, The Bad Beginning. So that's this book here. And so they're all excited about the ones that they got. And they are going to be happy to read those and go through those. All right, so let's go ahead and get these, get this dinner um, out of the refrigerator. So I just realized that I also have um, leftover lemon chicken piccata too. We might do that for lunch tomorrow because this lasagna was a huge hit last night. Yes? No. Are you gonna put raisins back in there? So it doesn't look very good right now, um, but that was a lasagna. It does not look appetizing in here, <laughs> but I promise it was so good. It's gluten-free, but with all of the cheese, so my youngest will probably have some um, either peanut butter and jelly sandwich or some chicken nuggets or something. A lot of times when we give him like the same kind of food we're eating, he doesn't even eat it. So I would rather give him something that we know he's going to eat and make something that we all enjoy even though it has dairy because he's like, in a super picky eating stage right now anyways so if i were to modify a lasagna to be dairy free he probably wouldn't eat it so until he's ready to eat things like this i'm going to keep making them as is and then just feeding him the things that i know that he will eat that are still um at least providing him nourishment so let me go ahead and get this heated up
right, dinner is served for our kids. So you're just gonna have some green beans and lasagna. Like I said, this is little guy's meal, a little bit of green beans, some sandwich and oranges. Um, there definitely was not enough green beans for my husband and I to get any. So we might either just get an extra serving or an extra, a big helping of lasagna or I could make another side, but I don't really want to. Um, or maybe him and I will have dessert. <laughs> we'll see. But now that our food is served up, we are pretty much done with the day. We're going to have dinner, do all of our Advent stuff, and then um, just hang out with our kids for a little while before they are off to take their showers and then get put to bed. So I'm going to go ahead and end this Vlogmas video here. Um, I'm sorry about the loud noise if you can hear it. It's my dishwasher, which is literally right there. Um, <laughs> and it's running right now. So um, I hope that you guys are enjoying these Vlogmas videos. So I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to upload Monday through Friday and just reserve Saturdays and Sundays as like days off just because um, last week um, it, it just gets to be a little bit much like having to remember to pull the camera out and do all the things. I know lots of people do it, but um, with this being my first time and I kind of just jumped right into it, I think that for my sanity, it is probably just going to be easier for me um, to just do a Monday through Friday upload schedule for the month of December rather than an everyday thing. And then in January, I will go back to my, no my normal Monday, Wednesday, Friday. So I'm thinking I will have like Christmas content curriculum videos, like normal things that you would find on my channel on Monday, Wednesday, Friday, and then do like these Vlogmas style videos on Tuesday and Thursday. Um, so if you guys are enjoying these Vlogmas videos, please hit that, um, that like button. And also if you are new to my channel, please hit that subscribe button. I would love to have you here as a part of my community. Um, I am really enjoying filming all of the Christmas content for you and bringing you guys along with us this Christmas season. Um, so I hope that you're enjoying it as well. And I will see you guys in the next video. Bye.